What's going on, guys? And welcome to day one of our forest adventures here on YouTube. I'm super looking forward to getting into this. It's going to be a great time. Obviously, I love the first game. I didn't do much of a refresher, though, on, uh, on what happened again. But hopefully, we can find out what happens in this. We can already see we're doing a bit of a dive here. Oh, and there's a bit of a, a raft there in the water. We'll have to go and visit that at some point. And see what secrets this land has to offer us this time. Uh, geez. It's already raining. We can see our trusty two uh, two colleagues here, Fish Eye and Kelvin. Kelvin's going to be our companion throughout this game. Thanks for those that watched the uh, first impressions, the first 30 minutes of the game. And uh, it's, it's been a, a blast playing this uh, on stream and stuff, so... I'm just super looking forward to getting into this here. So we've got a couple of people we need to find, which is Edward Pufton, Barbara Pufton, and also Virginia Pufton. We know who Virginia is. If you've been playing the game, you know who he is. And for those that have not played the game yet, I won't spoil it for you. But here we go. We can see the site map. The last transmission. We've got a couple of locations we need to go and check out. So let's start Sons of the Forest. Right. So there we have it. We've crash landed in the forest. There is, well, we've landed in the, there's three starting positions we could actually land in. You've got inside the forest, you've got the snow biome, and you've got the beach. And it does seem that we have started inside the forest. And oh boy, does this game look beautiful. Oh God, I wonder what that was then. Bloody Bambi over there. But yeah, this game looks beautiful. Like I've got everything cranked up. Showing you that crispy 4K if you've got the... Oh, hello. Kelvin. Get on your feet, soldier. we got a mission to do. Are you with us? Oh, he's bleeding from his ears. He's got a concussion. Okay, there we go. You right there, brother? Let's get you to follow me real quick. So we, we can give him, like, orders and stuff like that so he can follow us. He can, he can grab trees and he can clear an area of up to 20 meters. You can set it to do, like, 5, 10, 20. And uh, you can just take him on a break and stuff. But there are other companions we can get later down the line. And we might even see one this episode, so... Let's do what we normally need to do in the forest and let's just grab our, our cases here. Grab our supplies. And then we need to find somewhere of shelter because we need to get out of this storm. Because it's cold. And as you can see in the bottom right hand corner right now, 
there is a little light blue bar on my blue bar, if that makes sense. Right at the tippity top, like at 12 o'clock on my bar. And because that is light blue, it does mean that we, our stamina is not full. And depending on the weather and depending on how cold we are, it actually does affect our stamina. So we've got to keep that into account. Right, Kelvin? Are you with me? So we do have a tarp here. Oh, we've got a grenade and some explosive there as well. And this tarp we can actually put down and put some sticks underneath it. And create a little bit of shelter for tonight, you know. But surviving the first night on most games, as you know, is usually a little bit rough. But I don't think we'll see any... Any, any cannibals soon. So I think what I want to do, to be honest, is, is that let's have a look into our inventory pack and let's open our emergency pack here. And let's open this up. And we can see that we have our... Our GPS tracker, a tactical axe, our gu uh, guidebook, and also our lighter. Our lighter is actually electronical. Uh, electronical? Electric in this one. Uh, which is pretty cool. So let's put all these away. And let's put our bag out here. We've already got our, our, our axe equipped. We don't need a stick on there, to be honest. We've got a king oyster, which we could uh, we could eat. Can we eat that? I actually don't know. We've got a grenade. We've got some medications. And we've got our... Uh, GPS here, which we can equip. We've got a little butterfly here and some wire. We can change the colour of the lights. We can turn the lights on. We can change these to your own personal preference. I kind of like this. It's pretty cool. But then, oh yeah, that's a good point actually. This inventory is absolutely massive. We've got down here where items get placed, up here, up in this top left, literally this whole UI. The boxes, the ceiling of the boxes. We've got the backpack. We've got over here to the right. Your skulls all come down to the left. And then you've got all your personal belongings down here. Like your, your jumpers, your hoodies that we're going to be collecting. So, let's put our thing away here. And let's see if we can just get a couple more rocks and some pebbles and all that kind of good stuff. I thought we might have to pick that up though. But we can't. And God, this is the soldier that fell out. And the, the door landed on him. Let's have a couple more of these pebbles. And get a stick as well. I'm going to make a spear because... Obviously, spears are important in this. So let's put two sticks down. Some duct tape and our knife. And we can make ourselves a trusty little spear. And let's uh, put that away, but let's equip that onto our backpack here. Just like that. I'm just thinking if we should get some dinner for tonight. We try and get our, our Bambi over here. I don't think he sees us. He does. Damn it. I was a little bit late on that. There is one over there that's just sitting down. Let's see if we can try and get him. So we need to eat. I think we've got enough supplies, but hopefully... I don't think he's... Uh, I can't throw this that far. Oh, there we go. <laughs> we got him. Nice. Let's get some meat. Hopefully we can get him outside of the water here. Oh, we can. We can get him uh, in the water, sorry. Let's carve him up. Let's throw him away. Did we get some meat there? Or what happened? Did you see what happened there? I don't think we did. I think it's because he's in the water. It's a bit of a... Bit of an issue. Oh, look. Where did we go? I managed to get some. I, it's just that it did some weird physics right there when we... <laughs> when I stabbed him. With my knife. What are you doing, Calvin? That's a tree. Got the blood just coming out of his ears. God damn it. Imagine. Imagine that. All right, buddy. We're going to go and find a place to rest. Let's get that rock away. Let's see if we can find some of the squirrels and rabbits here as well. There's another deer. Some more. What's that? What's that noise? Let's get my spear out just in case. The thing is as well, if we do see any cannibals, I'm going to put my spear away. I don't want to come across as a threat right now. Because they have got an intelligence system in this. Oh. What is this? Oh, it's the baton. It does have a charge though. Battery charge. Wait, that's screw dead? Hello? It is dead. 
free meat. It's got a button now. Is this... Okay, this is going to go over to this side. I don't like to follow this stream down, or I would like to find a nice little flat location. Oh, there's another box here as well. Another flat location where we can build our little starter base. A little, our first camp for the night. So I'm just wondering, let's open the map up here and uh, see what we've got. So we can use the middle mouse button to actually zoom in and zoom out and we can see where everything is. You can see the starting location, so if you guys are playing along or, or all that kind of stuff. So let's have a look. We can see there's a, a lake down here. There's also another one that way with a couple of paths leading towards it. I don't know which one to head to. I just don't want to stumble across a uh, a cannibal camp right now, you know. Let's put that away. I do need to have some pills here because I am super low on health. There we go. That should help us. Let's grab a spear. Let's just follow this stream, see where it takes us. Okay, so we're getting there. We're getting pretty close now, to be honest. Oh. Oh, no. Got a couple of tents. And a couple of bodies. I have to keep my head on here on a swivel, so we... Any cannibals around? There is cannibal factions as well. We've got kind of like the clan ones, and then we've got kind of like these outcasts, which, which I like to call stalkers. Because they're very stealthy, and you don't see them until you actually look. And they, they'll peek around trees and hide in bushes, and they've got a low profile. So what's this? Golf balls. Hank, you spent all this time setting up a golf course, and you hadn't any... <laughs> I haven't uh, ordered any golf balls or clubs. How are we supposed to play golf, Miles? Oh god. We've got some golf balls here. We can actually sleep in this tent if we wanted to. Might actually quickly save that. God, the sounds, the flies and... Everything just sounds grim. We can sleep in there. We've got a tent each, old Calvin, if we want to stop here. But I don't think I want to hang around these dead bodies. If I'm not mistaken, we should be able to break these and possibly get that flesh. I don't think so. Maybe not. Oh, some rope. We definitely need that, though. Watches. Another, can another canister here. Alcohol. Just remember, if you're new to this game, make sure you press F and not hold F when you're grabbing stuff. Because if you hold F, it's in action. And if you pick up some raw meat, you'll eat it. So, just be careful of that. What's on this here? Devil's... Devil's Club. I don't think I want to set up camp next to somewhere that's got dead corpses on sticks. I definitely want to live next to a body of water. There's something there in the water, actually. Is that... The person that's up there with a the golf ball's friend. Oh, there's a turtle right there. It's like a snapping turtle or... Is there anything on this guy? God, that's terrifying, isn't it? Imagine if he just looked at us right there. Oh, boy. I think I want to keep shifting down to this course line down here. And we have got a, like a marker in this general direction as well. But I don't want to head there just yet. Because I feel like if that's going to be a point of interest and there's going to be cannibals, I don't want to agitate them before we even set up any form of system. Well, I think heading down to this course might be a good idea, to be honest. <laughs> Jesus! Bloody hell. Calvin, we need to move. That made me jump then. We're just arriving at the beach as well. The 
there he is. You can see why I call them stalkers now. When they're in the foliage like that, you can't see them. Just watching us in the bush right there. Okay, let's put my weapon away here. Just, I don't want to agitate him. You see, he's backing up. He doesn't want to be hostile. Obviously, Calvin uh, spotted him as well. So I'm nearly at the beach here. Oh, God, he's still following us. I don't know if he's going to... These guys kind of hunt in, uh, in packs. So we've got to watch out for him because he'll end up calling his friends over. Let's, let's pick up pace here and try and gain some distance. Calvin seems to be running around. There's that boat as well, that thing, for the raft we saw from the helicopter. I'm still trying to find a piece of flat land. Okay, so I found this little bit of flat land here, to be honest. And uh, there's a little bit of a stream up here as well. I think, I think this area might be decent. We've just got to clear down some of these trees and so I think I might get Calvin to start working on that maybe so let's get Calvin here let's get you and I want you to uh, uh, clear let's clear like 10 meters there you go start clearing 10 meters Just start, whilst he's doing that I'm gonna have a little bit of a scout around here yeah we can see we got a bit of a river here heading down Let's see if there's any camps around us. This actually, this river is pretty low. Oh, it's just going down to the ocean. Actually, that's a bit more of an open space over there. It's just, it's just on a bit of a hill. But we could do supports. I hear music. I can hear music. Oh no. Calvin. Yeah, we're not living here. There's a camp right here. There they are. At least two of them. They don't see me. But yeah, we definitely need to move from here. Let's, I'm going to go and get Calvin. It's definitely a place we can't live. Especially right next to our camp. I feel like... The, I feel like they're living next to... Uh, they're listening to some 80s pop. Oh, Calvin, watch out, dude. Oi, come here. Follow me. We could go across the lake, to be honest. But living so close to that camp is not going to be good for... When... F oh, we followed... He saw that. He's there. I don't know if he heard me before. But... We're definitely uh, not going near that. Okay. I think this might be it. I moved upstream a little bit. And it's that flat area I saw just upstream on the left. And their camp is just across there in that, in that little bit of forest. So we still have access to water and that. I feel like... We just build our base, maybe. On a couple of stilts. I feel like that can be done. Unless I build it across this water here. That could be in an interesting... There's one in the water right there. I don't know if you can see him, but... Oh God, everything... This is... This is difficult. This is... Oh my, there's one there as well. God damn it. 
They're everywhere. All I'm trying to do is just find a decent place to put up put up camp. Without being in the vicinity of a a cannibal camp. Okay, so it's already 17 or 8 right now. And it's about to start going dark. We can start to see the sun setting, so I feel like we should set up camp and try to survive our first night, so. Let's get our let's get our tarp down here. I'll make some form of shelter. I love the new building mechanic in this. So much more uh, cleaner. Let's get another stick on this side. I don't know why there's like this moment of uh, just freezing right there. A little bit weird. Well, let's get a let's get a couple of sticks as well. Let's equip that. And put you down, snap you. And, uh, let's light you up. I'm afraid to look up right now and something's going to be looking at me, you know. Especially the stalkers. Let's have a couple of these sticks. Let's, uh, let's rest up for the night. Oh, okay. Good morning, Kelvin. I'm gonna have some food here. I've got an MRE pack. Let's have that. We've got some... I think that's vodka. I don't, I don't want to be drinking that. Got, got a little bit of food here. I think I, I should have really cooked this food, right? It's all I forgot I had that. From the uh, the squirrel and the, the bambi earlier. Let's, uh, let's cook some of this food. Let's throw that raw meat on there. Hopefully the cannibals can't smell it. Oh, a bit of money and some leaves as well. Get a fire roaring a little bit. Just chillier. Oh, he's crouching as well. I like how he does what I do. I'm my little trusty companion throughout this journey. Oh, that's a bit. I was trying to grab that right there. There we go. So I do still need something to eat. I'm going to leave that there. I, there is no... Let's pick up this. We don't need this anymore. Let's, uh, if we hold hold C, we can actually collect what we dropped. And let's go back to that stream. It should be in this general direction. Because we do need to get a drink of water. Alright, here we go. Let's get another one. And fill our... Fill our thirst up. Okay, let's let's cross this. Seems like a bit of a rocky bridge. Gotta remember there was one in the water here, so have to keep our like I say on a our head on a swivel. Let me try and climb this. Oh, we can. All right, Calvin's over there. Oh, he's not. He's behind us. He actually followed us, followed us over. Oh. Oh, there she is. There she is. Virginia. She's not on our side yet, but... We've got to earn some trust with her. She knows we're here. Hey, she sees us. Just got to watch out for the cannibals that we know are roaming them woods behind her. Especially with that pathway. But to be honest, that could have been a patrol. Just a, a lawn patrol going up and down there. Got a waterfall here, though. This could be nice and flat. Here we go. A little island in the middle. I'm just kind of thinking, what do we feel about... Building a little... A little house on here, a little bit of a camp. Actually, it's a little bit too small, isn't it? Oh, there's a couple of uh, stuff here. Can I? Oh, I can actually open that with a rock. Got some cloth though. Oh, some berries. Definitely take, take these. Can definitely help in dire times of when we need 
Oh, it's a duck. Oh, here we go then. This is it. This is the land we shall call home. Right next to this turtle. I'm going to call you Trevor. You can be our friend. Oh no, there is a stalker over there though. That's okay. There's a bit of fog there. What's that about? What's that about? Can we get... It's a bit misty. Is this because we're, we're up high or something, or...? Okay. Alright. Where's Calvin? I don't see him right now. He's across the water still. He's trying to figure a way across here. So, the good thing about the AI in this is they don't teleport to your location. He's going to try and find a path in to get to me now. So without him, you know, jumping over here like most other, you know, typical games do, that he'll kind of teleport over here, but he'll make his way across. But I think let's start chopping some wood down and getting a little bit of a foundation down. So let's get our axe out here. Let's start chopping. Timber. Oh, you get so much more wood than the first one. I feel like I'm being watched, though. All right, I'm just going to kind of keep grouping these up over here. Just need to keep grabbing more. There's a lot of trees around here, at least. And we've got a bit of open space. So a bit of a heads up as well. Obviously, if your stamina depletes... And you're still hitting a tree whilst your stamina's low. You're actually going to do less damage to the tree and it'll take longer to chop down. Let's grab these. Put these down over here. What's taking Kelvin so long? I'm worried. He's still on the edge of that island. I don't know if he's lost. Let's go and check on him. Oh, I think he's over here somewhere. I just don't know where. Oh. It's Virginia. Let me put my weapon away. Maybe she'll say hello. Hi there. Yeah. We need to earn some trust with her for sure. Okay, so apparently Calvin's here. Has he drowned? Um, Calvin, I don't, I don't think you're supposed to be here, buddy. Uh, um, I think we might have lost Calvin. I think his pathing's gone a little bit. Oh, that's going to be a bit of a pain, isn't it? Can he not climb up here? Can he follow me, Calvin? Oh, your spoon. This way. Come here. Can you walk over here for me? Come on, I don't want to drown. Oh, she's still here as well. Yeah, he's definitely having an issue right now. Oh, come over here, Calvin. Over here. Come on. He's trying to climb up, but he can't. <laughs> God damn it. That's going to be rough. Ah, uh, there we go. Okay, so I, I just had to reset real quick, and that kind of seemed to have helped him out. Okay, so at least we've got him back now. I had to quickly set up a tent here, reset the game, and come back in, because obviously that was a bit of an issue, and hopefully it wasn't going to be permanent. So let's get this down. Uh, for some reason, I can't seem to pull my tent down anymore. There we go. Let's uh, Hopefully he finds a new tracking right now. So I'm not gonna I'm not gonna swim over to the island. I'm gonna actually run around it and see if that actually helps. Cause that was a bit weird. Okay, step away. Step away, brother. 
Okay, Calvin does seem to be making his way around now. Slowly. But I've got jobs to do. I need to set this... Oh, God, there's so many of them around here. Maybe we've got to set up some traps at some point. Because if these uh, get agitated, they're going to try and knock my door down. It's going to be terrifying. Look, they're all, they're, there's about three of them now. They've been following me, following me around that coast. It does seem that my logs have gone since I've had to do a reset. So I do need to chop some more trees here. Right, let's get chopping away. Let's get a pile of logs done. Oh, look who's decided to join us. It's about time. Jeez. I'm gonna get some, give him some jobs to do already. Let's get him to uh, start piling some logs here. I've been piling some logs up whilst he's been away, but let's give him, let's get logs and drop here. And hopefully he can help me out whilst I'm doing it. Is he, oh my, you're not, are you? He's going to get my piles of logs and move my piles of logs to it. What an absolute spoon. What a great help, Calvin. Thank you. What I'm going to do whilst he's doing that is I'm going to start setting up some supports for this house. So I'm going to... I think I'm going to put it on stilts, I think. I'm going to chop this in half. And start making it... Maybe look over, over that way, I think. Got to make sure I've got enough room to put walls around. For some security. So now that I've put that there, I should be able to... Yeah, you can see we've got a snapping point right there. So if we line this up here... There we go. We've got ourselves a little bit of a grid. So I've, I've got some... Um, logs left over there right now from when I was chopping the trees. I'm trying to line this one up as well. There we go. Oh, need to cut that in half, don't I? Let's just pull that out first, actually. I could have just chopped it there and then I saw the indicator at the, the last minute. Oh, let me place this one here. That's lined up, isn't it? Yeah, that should work. Yeah, there we go. He's getting the ones that I was what, down that hill. I'm curious about this fog, though. Kind of creates a nice, some nice um, atmosphere around the camp. Oh, Jesus. Oh, we've got company now as well. We've got some stalkers. Yep, yeah, Calvin's running. He's seen them. They're probably going to follow him up here, aren't they? Oh, we just can't get away from them. Where's he going? Is he... God. Bloody hell. What's our size right now? Oh yeah, we've seen Calvin. There's one right there with him. Calvin doesn't like it. I don't want to agitate him right now. I don't want to become a threat because then more and more will come. And as soon as the leaders start coming, they'll start getting a bit... Yeah, I know, Calvin. He's pointing at them. Oh, he's just throwing a rock at him. Did you see that? He threw a rock at Calvin. Calvin, just be careful, buddy. I'm just wondering if he's been frightened now to maybe go and get, get logs or... What are you climbing on there? There's no more logs for you to collect. Tell you what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put these down here. And Calvin, I want you to follow me real quick. Follow me. Come here. I'm gonna take him into these trees, and then I'm gonna tell him to start chopping these down, clear an area of 20 meters. And then once he's got a couple of trees down, I'm gonna get him to start bringing them over here. I don't know if that's gonna be too far though. All right, here, Calvin. Clear. Let's do just do ten meters for now. Ten meters. All right. 
I'll carry on working on this. I'll come and grab some logs in a minute. Oh, my guy's tired. Jesus. They were just hiding in the bush. Don't throw rocks at me, I swear. I will I will start launching arrows at you. Alright, good at get away. Just hiding in the bush like that, you see that? That's terrifying. No No threat to you. There's one under the house now. Oh, they're attacking him. Okay, I can't have this. If they're attacking Calvin, they're going to attack me, you know. He's just run over there. Go. Back up. I'm going to show him dominance. Back up. Back up. Get out of here. Oh my god, there's more of them. Like they're calling out to each other. Okay, they seem to be retreating now. There's one up in that tree. I will try and get a little bit of a shack going at least. Okay. Got our first victim. We're gonna have to burn the body. I didn't want to do this too early, but I feel like it was necessary. Let's get some rocks around this as well. I need one more. we go. Okay. He's pointing. Oh, no. God damn it. Oh, my God. I think he was coming to collect the body, but... My God. Okay, he's seen what's happening now. Yeah, he's just witnessed that. He knocked Calvin down, though. Hopefully we can set up some traps at some point. Is he coming for me now? Oh, he is. I didn't want to be doing this on day one. I need to remember to hold tab, which is what I've set my inventory to as my keybind. Instead of... The I key. Okay, I need to eat. Is this food okay? Cooked meat. It is. Let's eat this. I do need to sleep. I need to check what time it is as well. But it seems like this build is going to take a little bit of a time. Oh, them stalkers in the trees, in them bushes are low-key terrifying. It does seem to be a little bit calmer now, though. <laughs> Jesus! Bloody hell. He's there. <sighs> Calvin, we need to move, man. We need to hurry up. Yeah, look, he's looking at the bodies. <laughs> Missed him. 
Okay, I heard some trees going down, so... Wait, this body's still here. I think this might be attracting him. He's not burning. Is that going to help? There we go. Alright, he's chopping some trees down now. He's working on what I wanted him to. Good lad. He knows his priorities now. Okay, so let's try and make her some form of flooring right now. Alright, I'm gonna have to set up camp here because it's getting way too way too dark. I don't trust the night time. So we're gonna sleep until morning. Oh god, they're waking up as well. I'm gonna leave this little tent going here, but we got a lot of bones. Let's pick as much as we can up here. Oh we got way too much. I'm just wondering here if we if we look into our build our handbook here we can see that this is the new build mode but if we hold x we can go over to like the forest one kind of style and we can you know get a pre-built one and what i'm after is i'm after maybe oh god we still we do have traps bone maker trap and a fly swatter trap We've got a couple of traps in here, which which definitely we're going to have to do. Some towers and lookout posts. I think uh, what I would like to get, if possible, is a, uh, a bone storage right here. I'm just going to set this up at the side right now. Just like that. Fill that with sticks. And put my bones in there. Oh god, this can hold a lot more than what it could in the first one. And put the rest of them in there as well. I believe this is double side. It is, so we can pull a lot more. Kelvin's still bringing the logs up here, which is good. And he's chopping trees down over there to get the logs. Because we're nearly done with the flooring. It is going to take some... Oh, he's being chased again. Oh, that one's moving fast. I'm just wondering if I can make a club here. I'm getting to... You're getting too confident. Oh, he dropped a pouch, though. This, where, did, where was that? Right there. So let's have a look. Where is it? It's down here. Skin pouch. What's in this? Oh, we got some rounds. Oh, the zero... Zero rounds in it though, it's a box. And some duct tape. You got any more uh, logs for me over there? Okay, well, I've got the. F oh, there's so many of them. Calvin's being chased as well, way over there. Yeah, they're getting way too aggressive now. I didn't want this to happen on day one. <sighs> and to be honest, speaking of day one, I think we need to end this one here. And hopefully next time we can get some walls and traps up or something. I wanted to get a lot more done today, but these guys have been a pest. So thank you so much for watching. If you've enjoyed this video, like, subscribe, and also check out my other content right here. And as always, keep smiling.